Good morning, guys. How's it going? Today is October 2nd, and it's like 8.15, and of course, I'm on my way to work. I wanted to pull out the camera because there were a couple of things I wanted to address. First off, I'm just at a loss of words for this mass shooting in Las Vegas. I don't know how many people are going to have to lose their lives before there starts to be real talk and focus on like gun control. It's just ridiculous and it's so senseless that it's just, it's almost like infuriating. I mean, and you guys know that I was recently in Vegas, so it's like, you know, it's almost starting to become scary to go anywhere. It's like any place a, sh a shooting can break out and it's just, uh, I don't know, it's devastating. So thoughts and prayers go out to the people who were at this concert, um, people who are no longer with us, the family of the victims, and just the people who did survive, how like that trauma is gonna be for them. It's just, it's just hard. So yeah, that, that really hurt me this morning waking up to that news. It's, it's like, ugh, so frustrating. So yeah, I just wanted to start out the video with that. Um, second thing is it's October 2nd and I had every intention of doing Vlogtober. Um, you guys haven't seen me for a little while just because I've been trying to vlog with my GoPro uh, just because the quality of the videos are better with the GoPro and when I tell you I've had so many setbacks and complications like you wouldn't even believe it like I'm trying to make better videos but GoPro won't let me be great like my computer won't let me be great be great I'm just running into so many technical difficulties and between just like working full-time and trying to like maintain a house or apartment and just life you know it's hard I have little room for error when it comes to filming videos um, otherwise I just I don't have the time to put them up because I have so many other things going on so um, yeah I'm sorry about that I, I have been filming and for whatever reason I just keep getting error messages that my files are corrupt after I go to try to upload them so it's just been a problem after problem so I apologize. Yesterday I took the camera with me all day. I did some cool stuff stuff for Sunday, um, including I went and got my nails done. And I am just in love with this color. It's like a sparkly plum color. I'm obsessed. It's so pretty, and it's just perfect for fall. Um, so yeah, I took you guys. I took the camera with me yesterday, and it would have been a really good vlog, but unfortunately, it just didn't work out for me to be able to upload the footage. So yeah. Anyway, all that to say that I will be doing Vlogtober, so um, I'm excited, I'm nervous, um, but it's going to be good. It's going to be a great challenge, and I'm ready for it. So hopefully you guys are interested in seeing me every single day this month because I'm excited to give you guys videos, and you guys... Our trip to, Ch to Chile is rapidly approaching. So at the end of the month, Tom and I will be going to Chile. So we are super excited about that. Um, of course, I'm gonna have a lot to vlog about last minute things I still need to get. Um, it's actually going to be like in the 60s there. It's not gonna be like hot or anything like that. It's gonna be like in the 60s, I think, to the 70s. Um, so just temperate weather which I'm not super mad about. So long as they're not, there's not like snow that we have to trek through, I'm okay with it. Uh, I guess I'll see you guys after work. Hello, everyone. Hello. Uh, so, it is, what is it, almost six o'clock? Yeah. Jesus, five minutes to six. And, um, sorry babe. Tom and I are just getting home. How was your day, Boo Boos? Pretty good. Pretty steady. Did yeah. some work. Uh, did some work did at work? Did some work at work <laughs> and, uh, you know, called it a day. Yeah. Not, nothing stressful. Nice. So, pretty productive, though. That's good. Tom recently got a promotion, right, honey? <laughs> yes. Yes, indeed. So now, what? what's your new job title, sweetheart? 
senior consultant. Hey. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Senior consultant right here. Yep. Yep. Proud of him. Uh, thanks. Yeah. Um, yeah, today was busy for me. It went by fast, but it was pretty nonstop. So now with the new iOS, if you have iPhones, there's a new feature. It can sense, I guess, when you're driving. Mm. So then if you are driving, then if you get messages or notifications, you won't get them while you're driving. To kind of cut back on like um, text induced accidents, I guess. Um, and so like out of reflex, sometimes I'll reach for my phone, you know, when it's a red light, kind of reach for my phone. And it was kind of nice. Every time I reached for it, it kept saying, you're not getting notifications because you're driving. And it's like, because we live in a world where like, People expect you to be available all the time. You kind of get anxious. Well, I do personally about things. If I don't address things as soon as like it's requested of me. And so I finally just like, you know what? Like I'm driving right now. This is not the time to answer emails, to answer texts, to do anything other than focus on the road. Um, and I had just seen a car accident. So it was like super like aware of my, of the importance of just focusing on the road. So I kind of, you know, like that feature. So if you guys have iPhones, then I encourage you to turn that feature on. And when you're driving, just focus on, on driving and everything else that's happening, or, you know, wherever else you think, you know, needs your attention, just hold off. Because now I'm home, I'm safe, and I can address those other things that were seemingly so, like, important during the drive. Yeah, seems like a good feature. You know, probably save, save a couple lives. Yeah, so anyway, that's my soapbox. <laughs> Turn it on. Turn it on. <laughs> Turn it on. So now Boo Boo's is about to go for a run, right? Yes. I'm gonna eat um, dinner. And yeah, I don't know what else we're gonna do, but. What are you making for dinner? Mm, I was gonna have some more in my suit. Mm. What about you? Maybe me too. Is it still there? Mm -hmm. There's a bunch left. Mm -hmm. Sounds like a plan. Mm -hmm. Sounds like a plan. I'll probably eat while Tom's running because I'm a greedy fat monster and <laughs> I have to eat right when I get home from work and Tom can like wait all night. I eat a late lunch too. Yeah. I need snacks a lot more, I guess. Than I, I don't know. Mm -hmm. We both snack. I just snack on like savory things. He's more of a sweet snacker. Sweets. Yeah. Love the sweets. Gotta love it. What's up, guys? So, um, I'm in complete chill mode. Hair's up, sweats on, bra off. You know how it goes. Um, so I'm just having dinner and I wanted to show you guys what I'm having. It's my meal prep. So I meal prep some green beans and this is some salmon. And then right here is some soup that I made. It's a butternut squash and carrot soup. I put garlic and rosemary in it and it's so good. I made a big pot of it and I've just been, we've just been eating off of it the past week or so. I actually tried to make a video on how I make this soup and like I was telling you guys earlier I was having technical difficulties with a lot of my videos and this was one of them maybe in the future I'll be able to show you guys how I make this soup because it's so good so yeah I'm just gonna eat my dinner Tom's gonna go for a run and I'm just gonna catch up on some YouTube and yeah, just relax. I'm watching one of my favorite YouTubers. Her name is Elle Florence. She is a Canadian lawyer and she's just like on top of everything in her life. She's a lawyer. She has this YouTube channel that's really growing. She has her own uh, jewelry business, pearl jewelry. She just started her own scarf line. The girl is just a beast and she just very classic and traditional in terms of her style of beauty and wardrobe and lifestyle interests she 
pretty much cooks everything from scratch. You leave with, I told him it was Enrique. And I'm like, he's Enrique. Yeah, because we didn't know Enrique. Enrique Orochi was a guy Christina had We understand they can't, but you know, we had, we had to ask questions. We couldn't just sit and wait. They also had questions. Hey, boobos. Hey. Oh, are you taking a picture of me? You filming me? What's up? Just read a little Reddit. Getting my Reddit on. Watching some cute dogs. Some cute doggies? Uh huh. When are we gonna get our doggies? Soon. We gotta. We gotta start looking. We looked that one night. Yeah. Hello. <laughs> hey guys. So it is about that time. Um, it is the end of the night, so we wanted to close out the vlog properly. Um, hopefully you guys enjoyed this vlog. If you did, then what, babe? Subscribe. Mm -hmm. Like. Comment. Yes. Good <laughs> job. And yeah, hit the bell on your way out. That way you get notifications from us every time we upload. And yeah. Until the next video, you guys, we will see you later. Bye. Good night.